Some of you may remember the movie Glengarry Glen Ross, where they say, always be selling. Well, as a business owner, you should always be on brand. And so you'll always see me wearing blue with my blue background, but also my personality is gonna stay the same no matter if you meet me in a business setting or at a grocery store, or if you're just giving me a phone call. You wanna always be on brand. And so if you're a pleasant person, you should always be a pleasant person. I lately have been going through my cell phone contacts and calling people whom I completely honestly have forgotten what they do just to get re-familiarized. I've been in business since 2014, so the majority of the people I have in my contacts more than likely have their own business. Majority, I would say 95% of people are super pleasant. They're happy to reconnect. We let each other know what it is that we do. And I've even been able to send out some referrals. Now for the other 5%, some people are just being rude. They say, take me off your list. Well, I don't have a list other than my actual cell phone contacts. They'll say, oh, they're not interested. Oh, they need money, but they don't want to talk about what they actually do. Are you being on brand when you're being that rude to someone who may be sincerely trying to help you? Think about the energy you're putting out and think about how you're acting with people because at all times you are marketing yourself and you are showing off your brand. So make sure that no matter if you're on a video, in a sales meeting, networking event, grocery store line, or just on the phone, you wanna stay consistent to who you are. So show off who you truly are. Are you a pleasant person or are you cranky? And if your brand's cranky, then keep at it. If you have any questions about how to best show your brand on video, please schedule a complimentary strategy session. I'd love to help you. And leave in the comments, do you feel like people are mostly being their brand or do they turn their brand off and on? Let me know in the comments.